Okay, what is up everybody? We're back again with another video. Today we're going to be doing something a little bit different. We're going to be talking about how to get money fast at the beginning of the game. This does apply to later in the game, but not quite as much. But still, do stay on. There are some good tips in here. So, first of all, do the missions. These missions can give you a lot of money, and they do not take long. Like, some of the missions will only give you about $1,000, but some of them can give you $4,500 and even higher. Plus, most of them require you to get some kind of harvest, so you're getting that money too. So you can end up getting like seven, eight thousand dollars within like 10, 15 minutes, depending on how short or long the mission is. Second of all, this one is not an obvious one. Use the 243 with the soft point bullets. This is the gun you start off with and the bullets you start off with. If you notice and you go to the store, the bullets are free, so you can get as many as you want of these without paying a single cent so of course yes this does require more tracking but you get a hundred percent of your earnings as profits because you are not spending that money back to buying new bullets because they are free and second of all i would definitely recommend you to hunt a smaller game such as coyotes deer jackals or even wolves but wolves eh, i don't know might be difficult you might have to do a lot of tracking but definitely try going for that as well because they do give you a lot of cash third tip that i have for you is use the seven millimeter on rahunga or parque fernando for the pumas or the lions just because they will give you so much money and they're so easy to find for lions specifically i'll be making a video soon but as a core statistic they give you around 1000 k 1,600 to even 1,700 if it's a 9 legendary animal and that's for one kill so that is a ton of money especially for an animal that is so easy to find pumas they give you a little bit less cash but still they're easy to find there's even like a lake on parque that we literally call the puma lake i'll show you that in a video soon as well but just wait we're just getting started on this channel so fourth tip also pretty easy pretty easy to do you can do this at any point in the game so this is also for the players who are further on in the game or maybe like level 30 40 50 or even 60 who just want some cash to have fun in the game and that is to shoot everything you see don't go selective with what you shoot so if you see a level one white tailed deer go for it because it's cash anyway and it gets respawns up so if you're looking for a rare maybe you can get that rare by shooting all these animals Maybe that female comes back as a piebald, an albino, a melanistic, or whatever other animal you're hunting with a fur variation. So I definitely recommend that. And it also builds up those animal herds, especially if it's like white-tailed deer, black-tailed deer, or any other animals that are in huge herds, such as the Roosevelt elk as well. Uh, lastly, this one's kind of a bit of an odd one, but it's also really obvious. Don't waste your money on weapons that you won't use. For example, don't waste your money on the 338 or I think the 470 because they're just for weapon classes such as 789 or just exclusively for 9. And let's be realistic, how often are you going to be hunting water buffalo, cape buffalo or any other level 9 animal? It's much more effective to use something like the 7mm which goes from like weapon class 4 all the way up to weapon class 9. It's just a lot more effective, especially if you're trying to grind for that money or for like something that you want to buy. Another one that you don't want to waste your money on is clothes. Okay, later on if you're higher level and you play a lot of multiplayer, it might be funny to look like different. But don't waste your money on that in the beginning. The same thing with backpacks. They just create unnecessary noise and really you can get your loadout within three guns with all the collars that you need inside that 20 kilogram weight capacity. Uh, lastly, don't please don't waste your money on scents. Use it on collars because scents just don't work. They only last for 30 minutes in game time, I think it is, or there's 30 minutes real time. Not quite sure on that, but just don't use them. They don't work effectively. They're really inconsistent and they're really expensive. And collars are just a lot better. Or just go to zones if you're even trying to just save even more money. Just go to those zones. It's a lot, a lot more effective. Trust me. That were my top five tips. If you want to see another video, I have a few more tips, but I want, I'm going to do that in a different video. If you want to see those, make sure to like, 
If you're new around here, subscribe and remember to comment down below to let me know what you guys want to see differently or what you guys want to see in general. And yeah, that's it. Have a good day. Bye bye and peace.